To find the oxidation number for the Cr in CrSO4, this is chromium 2 sulfate, we'll use these rules here. We don't see a negative or a positive after the compound here. So it's going to be a neutral compound and all the oxidation numbers for the entire compound will add up to zero. The way to solve this is to recognize that this SO4, this is the sulfate ion. Sulfate ion, whole thing, always has a 2 minus ionic charge. And with ions, the oxidation numbers, they all add up to the charge on the ion. So sulfur and the four oxygens, their oxidation numbers, they're going to equal this 2 minus here. Because of that, the chromium, it has to have a plus 2 is its oxidation number. So our chromium here, chromium 2, that's why we call it chromium 2, because of the plus 2, has an oxidation number of plus 2. If we add all the oxidation numbers up, we get 0. If you need to find the oxidation number for the sulfur here in the CRSO4, there's a link in the description to help you do that. This is Dr. B with the oxidation number for the chromium in chromium 2 sulfate. Thanks for watching.